an Emmy nomination and a new movie coming out today that everybody's talking about. ABC 10's Mark S. Allen caught up with actor Don Cheadle to discuss it all. Mark? Yet yeah, no one was more surprised than Don Cheadle that he got nominated for an Emmy Award for a cameo that he made in Falcon and the Winter Soldier from the Marvel Universe on Disney Channel+. Plus. Reason he's surprised? He was only in it for 90 seconds, a one-time appearance. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. That got him an Academy, uh, rather, an Emmy nomination. Uh, he is in Space Jam 2, open today in theaters everywhere in IMAX. I suggest you see it on the big, big, big screen. LeBron James throwing it down like you've never seen before. Really amazing action. Don Cheadle said he was reluctant to see it. He'll explain. Take a look. I can't wait to see it. I'm looking forward to it. I saw LeBron at a, a party a couple weeks ago. And I said, have you seen it? He's like, no, I haven't seen it either. We're both, we both got the link and started to watch it and both turned it off and said, no, we want to see it in the theaters with people. On the big screen. Yeah. Uh, exactly. How nutty is it to do press? And you don't want anyone to plot spoil it, but at any given moment, me or the likes of me could be ruining this for you. Yes, so be careful, Mark. <laughs> be careful. Uh, although I think you probably read the script, but I can't wait for you to see it. It's awesome, sir. Me too, thank you. Uh, super good guy. Last time I saw Don Cheadle one-on-one, -on -one, he was shooting a movie in Northern California just a few miles from where we are now on the Forest Hill Bridge. All right, other Space Jam news. Yesterday, 24 hours a day ago uh, today, I was talking to this guy, Gabriel Iglesias. You might know him as Fluffy. He sells out arenas everywhere, or so I said yesterday. Boom! About an hour after we cleared, he announced right here on his Instagram page, Despite being vaccinated, Fluffy, Gabriel Iglesias, suffering COVID-19 right now. We wish him well. If he says he's recovering okay, we'll keep you posted on that. Back to you. Absolutely. Got to be better safe than sorry. Mark, thanks so much.